Hi, welcome to PCI SIG DevCon 2016. My name is Tori Lewis. I'm here to show you the advanced debug capabilities of the Synopsys Designware Core using PCI Express. Over here we have the Synopsys uh, HAPS DX7 prototyping platform. In this FPGA on the back side of the HAPS DX7 is the Synopsys Designware Core PCI Express IP. Here we have the Synopsys Phi Daughter card communicates to the HAPS DX7 board across these HAPS Track 3 connectors on the pipe interface. The Phi Daughter card then connects to the motherboard across the PCI Express Interposer from Teledyne LaCroix. So the Teledyne LaCroix PCI Express Interposer connects via this cable to the Summit T38 PCI Express Analyzer. So let's move over to the software window. I've already set this up so that the Synopsys Designware Core PCI Express is sending data from the endpoint to system memory at 785 megabytes per second. Previously, I took a trace, and we can see that these memory writes are being initiated again by the endpoint to system memory. Notice that they're all coming through cleanly without LCRC errors. Now what we're going to do is we're going to show off the advanced debug features of the DesignWare PCI Express core. Specifically, if I go to this Air Injection Control Group 0 register, I'd like to show you what happens when we turn on the new TLP LCRC Air Injection feature. Notice that this is bits 11 down to 8. We're setting them to all 0. We verify that up here. Also, we set the Air Injection count to zero so that the errors are inserted continuously. Now that we've set up the air injection control, let's enable that air injection for group zero. Once we do that, let's go back to our throughput window and we can now see that because errors are being injected on the first TLP, the throughput is halved. So it goes down to about 378 megabytes per second. Let's go to the analyzer and see what's happening. Taking a new trace, we then see that on TLP 3649, for example, the PCI Express core, because it's been enabled by the advanced debug features, the LCRC is corrupted. Now it's only going to corrupt it on the first packet. So 3649, correlate that down to here. Once the endpoint has replayed that packet, notice that there's no LCRC error. So the first packet gets the LCRC error. It receives a NAC packet from the root complex. Then the endpoint replays that packet. This explains why the throughput is halved down to 378 megabytes per second. Again, let's go back to the configuration viewer. Let's turn off air injection. And we'll see that the throughput again goes back up to 785 megabytes per second. So I've shown you the advanced debug features of the PCI Express core from Synopsys. Thank you for watching.